hi guys uh, welcome to my channel audio video me uh, recently somebody asked me if I can do a video on compressor okay what is a compressor compressor is a dynamic sound tool to reduce the dynamic range of the sound okay what is dynamic range the difference in decibels between the loudest and the quietest portion of the sound is called its dynamic range okay what I mean by that looking at this chart let's say I say uh, a letter and that letter is a when I say a it creates a sound wave and let's say it's this sound wave now the middle of that sound wave is 0 dB the loudest uh, part of that sound wave let's say it's plus 10 dB and the quietest is minus 40 dB so the difference in decibels between minus 40 dB to plus 10 dB is the dynamic range of this sound wave and that dynamic range is 50 dB okay uh, compressors they come in different uh, types uh, and they can uh, come as built-in inside the audio mixers like this one or uh, they come in as plugins inside digital work audio stations or digital audio workstations and uh, they become uh, in shape of uh, dedicated 19 inch rack units compressors they have six main parameters or controls threshold ratio attack release output or makeup gain and knee all compressors they have a graph called curve the x-axis uh, is the input signal the y-axis is the output signals and uh, uh, let's start with threshold what is threshold threshold is the point at which compressor is set up to take effect now this can be set up anywhere between minus 80 db to 0 db depending on the compressor uh, on your digital audio workstation you would see uh, minus 50 db to 0 db threshold settings okay when i set up threshold at minus 18 db then i'm telling the compressor that once the signal reaches minus 18 db start working ratio ratio determines how much compression should be applied or it determines the strength of the compression let's say if i select two ratio one and uh, the input signal increases 2 db above threshold point then only half of it should be compressed and only 1 db above threshold is output another example for 2 ratio 1 compression is let's say the input signal is 8 db above threshold point then half of it which is 4 db will be compressed and 4 db will be output 4 ratio 1 compression means uh, fourth of the uh, signal will be uh, compressed and uh, uh, there is a formula to calculate the output uh, which is on the screen uh, so uh, and I've uh, done an example as well so have a look and uh, you can calculate the output if you want attack attack is a time based uh, uh, control that determines how fast the compressor should start working uh, release is also a time-based uh, uh, tool that determines how long the compressor should stay in effect before it goes back to its uh, original level uh, knee knee it determines how hard or how soft uh, the compressor should start working so if I select hard knee uh, when the signal reaches threshold point the compressor just starts acting right away and uh, when I select soft knee can you see there is a difference in the curve now so the when it reaches 
when the signal reaches minus 18 dB, the threshold point, the compressor starts working gradually. Okay, the last control is uh, uh, output or makeup gain. Okay, if I speak into the microphone, you can see that at minus 18 dB, the compressor starts working. But there is a reduction in gain to the overall signal. Now, in order to compensate that reduction, we use makeup gain or output gain. Uh, because if we don't use that, then the overall uh, signal uh, or, or the sound will be low. We have explained uh, in simplest uh, words what a compressor is and why we use it and what is the purpose of it and I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, I'll leave some notes on this video as well uh, uh, so you guys can do some research if you want to do some research on a compressor. Thank you. Bye-bye.